Bowser is in our sights, and we are going to get to him. Hey, everybody, man, it's Nick Chow. Welcome back to, life, to Super Mario Galaxy 2. Last time, we had some strange creatures looking at us in our epic battle. And we also faced against, well, Bowser Jr. And we, fi and we finally got rid of him. This time, as this uh, map is any indication, we are finally here at the final world. Oh, I see, we have 100% this place. <laughs> So let's go and uh, go into the world, into the six worlds. <laughs> I want to get to that uh, strange, uh, that there is a out of place uh, galaxy here, which I want to go to. This is my main focus on the entire episode. I will ignore anything else unless we're only able to get there. Melty Monster Galaxy, the Magnificent Magma Sea. <laughs> it looks beautiful too. I really like what they're gonna do with all the magma in this place. Also, this music is amazing. I forgot about this music, how, how dare I. <laughs> okay, Luigi, please. Um, it really is an epic team. I really do agree with it. And the main gimmick of this place is Magmars. Magmars are everywhere. So you want to play very carefully with Magmars. So I recommend playing this very carefully. My ideal solution for this... There we go! Now the magma here, and there's a magma ready for us. Go! Now we're into, into the magma sea. Ow! Ow! Fuck it. Totalus. And also magma waves. We really ought to see a magma. So I recommend put, not standing on the complete dark places. That is a no no. We <laughs> like that they have those things there. Oh boy. <laughs> this is a really cool place, and I really agree with it. Despite being so hot. Why well, not? Because I don't need it. <sighs> really like the view. Use these poles. I recommend staying on the top so that you don't get burned, maybe. <laughs> the fact that that thing is kind of obvious at this point. Right, we're. Uh, oh boy! Bubbles. <laughs> and actually, they were actually are called bubbles. <laughs> and, yep, this is another place where Magmar is, is really just hogging around the place. Also, Bowser loves using them then right now. This is not the last time you actually see a Magmars. Okay, you need to jump. Maybe uh, Luigi is an ideal person for this. I'm just going to uh, basically run over here. Luigi Captain! Still not uh, Oh, we have a waterfall side bit. Interesting. A lava fall, actually. No, it's just a lava fall. Is interesting. Oh god. Uh. Uh. Tornado saved me. So yeah, this place is really, really daunting. <laughs> so get the coin and line to set up there. Yep! More Magmars! But they're in a different kind. You can tell where they are from the... where they will appear... from that... from that thing. From the... from the platforms themselves. I recommend being careful because of that. Interesting. 
Uh, yeah, there is the uh, our thing. Yeah, this is crazy. We have magmars, magmars everywhere. Taking a leisurely stroll on this place with this epic music here. And you're still at them. You need to get over there. <laughs> well, that's well uh, easier than. Okay, <laughs> so now we got all these mag, we got rid of all these magmars. <laughs> Let's see if we can get to a to a very nostalgic place, but we're not done yet. <laughs> oh, seems we have. Oh, I know what's happening. We're having the use of the coins now. Go so just appear in multi monster galaxy. I want to get past that golden golden place, the first planet. Come on, this world five. Uh, isn't it the prank? What is this? I'm gonna just. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Hunger, another um, hungry mouse speed. Oh, this is actually a really interesting one. Um, this is where you use your coins. Okay, so let's just get. Um, let's just explain that since I don't want to make things in the dust. You of course have no need for the coins outside of well, basically black and white. There is another use of the coins that you may want to use. One hundred coins for five spins. You get five chance cubes for one hundred coins. Oh, so good, but I'm feeling so good. So full, but I'm feeling so good. I'm thinking about the transform. Compared to 30 starters for once, then you never even like you use your. Whoa, one ups! One ups everywhere! Yeah, this is savagery right here, one ups. This is where you can ground your one ups. Where is my one up? Uh, another one up. Just one up, one up. Just one up, one up. We really love that uh, team, that uh, th and then it just respawns immediately for you can use another five coins for that. <laughs> well, that yeah, I really love that. That's a really cool thing. Um, I guess we're gonna take a detour. <laughs> I think this is also the place where the most annoying boss in the entire game. Let's just see what's in the air, uh, since I can't ignore it. Uh, please tell me it's a daredevil one. Day. I'm pretty sure it's daredevil. Okay, the toy room, the toy tank returns. Boost day machine, daredevil one. Let's just get this over with. Oh! Oh, Andre, nice. We have to be go from the very beginning. Lucky this place is the most tre threatening. This is the most devastating one. Also, these guys are you no know, mess with me. But... I mean, like the music has changed from uh, from Bowser Jr.'s normal thing to uh, this. I really like there is also ice on the that the uh, star bits were on the ice of the of the Mega Hammer. That's just his name. Good, managed to get uh, that out of the way. Now we're on the base in the clear. Let's get one up. Dead center. Of course, these guys are, of course, a big pain in the butt. So you want to play careful with me. The kick is always the most awesome thing in this entire game. Outside, what we're going next? <laughs> what I'm, what my plan is on this entire, on this. No, 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 no. Let me first get the starters. I want starters. I really want the starters. 
I think Bowser Jr. itself also is a big problem. Because, well, his boss is the of course, a chaotic one. This, too, is also it's also a Dark Matter. Instead of, uh, we have to deal with, uh, a, uh, a goop, uh, a black hole, we have Dark Matter. Yeah, yeah, it really is different now if we have Dark Matter instead of a black hole to deal with. And a moving platform as well. Well, let's get that one on back. <laughs> Maybe like rushing head first might be a good idea. Yeah, he did, yeah he, they don't give you any coins. They only give you star bits if you kill. If you kill, kill it at the kick. So now I know that, that's good. That's like kind of good to know. Since I knew that was something different. Since I knew that this place was supposed to be different. Okay, wait until it get, um, wait, wait. And uh, now. This hole. Yeah. Dark matter. <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. Yeah, basically on a different level, basically. It's literally it's just a different level. Yeah, but the boss fight is literally the same. <laughs> we don't like the miss for, uh... For, uh, I don't know about drama, except for his footsteps. My dad's gonna get angry if I let you get another grand star. Time to break out my Boomsday Machine! I'll just relax in my comfy cockpit and watch you go BOOM! There it goes. Alright, Bowser Jr.'s last stand. <laughs> Let's see if we can do this. I feel like the main problem, the only main problem in this, in this, uh, in this uh, phase is really the electric bolts. And when you approach you off with electricity. Now comes the uh, wind turbine. Yeah, this music is off. You do like Bowser music. Yeah, I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! He was gonna fight sucking those clouds. <laughs> now comes the. Uh... Alright, Junior, let's go. Wait until this, uh, that thing is done. Right now. This. Now needs to go over Bowser Jr. Get ready to die! <laughs> Just for uh, funsies. Alright, we got out of here Bowser Jr. for the last time. <laughs> this is what really will be the last time we have to deal with Bowser, any of Bowser Jr. stuff. 
The little bat is done. <laughs> For real this time. <laughs> and remains of course is Bowser. Right, let's go back uh, into another world. And deal with this uh, planet and see what's going to happen. I'm not going to do the Hungry Moon stage yet. I'm not going to do it yet. I know what I'm going to do. A stroll down rolling lane. Oh, Arceus, no! No! Oh, this is the most annoying thing in the entire game. Oh, they basically let you proceed hell. Oh, please tell me that this pipe is something good. More hell. Ah, roll over the enemies or you gain lots. Fine, fine, fine. Five thousand points in order to get this. Um, basically, I recommend getting strikes. You have to deal with these guys known, known as pinheads. I love their name. It's really it's called pinheads. Jump at the A button here. That's too paranoid. <laughs> there we go. I love those pin those pinheads. You really just cower in fear when they do when they saw you just strike at them. This should be the one with the last thing. I really need to hit five of them. Yes! I thought that would be a, a, a difficult thing, but no, I did it. Why did you get 5,300 points, but I forgot to acknowledge you as my greatest rival, and I give you a, a um, star to prove it. <laughs> also, I like the background of dark matter around us. This is so seriously creepy, but really cool at the same time. With the uh, dark matter. Threading, <laughs> but cool. So, a little bowling, apparently that shows how good I am in the bowling. <laughs> the bowling challenge. It was an awesome one. Yeah, I didn't get any points to start since those pinheads want to drop to me. Alright, now let's deal with hell. <laughs> I wonder if we're going to a lot of places with hell. Okay, whatever. Whatever, we're going to places that you might recognize. A stroll down rolling lane, yeah, I guess it's actually, we're actually going down rolling lane, but also to, to, uh, memory lane soon. And I'm not actually, not joking. I knew it, I knew it, I knew where to deal with this thing. Okay, so in case you want to know what we have to deal with, this is basically, uh, no, a most, one of the most tedious things in the game. I don't think we're going to deal with the hardest stage is the last, but we do have a break at some at the, some point. Which actually the place where I'm actually want to end up with the last thing I actually want to show in this entire place. In this entire video. Also now we're able to break these new, these uh, crystals in the same way as we did with this with film Shimari. But the destroying enemies don't do that. I recommend you use of these, uh, boundaries, these walls, that's kind of get help you. Or, I highly recommend using the, uh, jump Z technique, that's what I'm gonna call it, okay. Uh, basically what I mean by that is, if you, um, press A, press Z, you basically get out of your thing. I will show you soon. Okay, I guess that's kind of disabled for this mission. Great! I can use my technique. Mm. 
I want to start this more interesting. <laughs> and brand new things. Yeah, yeah, basically, getting out of your wall thing. Yeah, you also get a lot of one-ups too, that's kinda cool. Simply by crushing your, your, uh, these things. Disable all of that technique is disabled in this, uh, mission. It's shred of one word. Hmm. Nah, I got you. Ah, uh, that's really, this really, I know this is straight, this is really one of the most, yeah, like I said before, this is one of the most tedious things in the entire game. And once again, back to one other one up, so I'm going to get another one soon. Yeah, my God. See? <laughs> I'm going to get that one up soon, soon, in 3, 2, 1. <laughs> Sometimes maybe let the game do things for you. <laughs> that's a good idea. And there we go! That's a cool, that's a cool, uh, that's a really fun mission. Got a lot of star bits. <laughs> Four hundred star bits in my belt. <laughs> that's a really, that's a good way to uh, grind up your star bits. <laughs> Since you always get more than one hundred. Uh, now we're going to uh, the Clockwork Ruins, since this is of course, uh, I know that it's actually a, uh, at the, I'm pretty sure that, uh, yeah, I'm going to show, I'm able to at least show at least mo well, three more uh, stars, stars soon. Time for adventure, and guess what music we're going to add soon? Guess what music we're going to add, we have, we, we, this is, yeah, we have my favorite music in the entire game. Uh, I mean, exactly, my favorite music you'll listen to the next one. Ah, uh, yep, Slips and Galaxy. Luigi, you can have some adventure time, though. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh yeah, I remember now. There is indeed a, a uh, hidden star here, which requires you collecting star bits, I believe? Uh, let me just see for myself. Because I know there is a Hunky Luma here. Ah. I just realized that there's a Hunky Luma here. <laughs> right. Oh, yeah, it's definitely, uh, definitely star bits. I'm pretty sure it's like the total of 50, if it's out of my head. Uh, I do need to die sometimes that kind of screwed up some things since it was really, that was really good that I didn't know how to die though, right? Kind of die dying is also kinda of good since you don't have so you get a lot more star bits too. Because you're able to keep your star bits and star bits actually go through other goes with your life too. So just look at this. There's a coin. There's a coin. Let me collect also all the coins too, just in case. It's maybe a hundred, but I'm not 100% sure because I forgot this uh, the uh, hundred limo mission. I don't think it's going to be that. Yeah, I need to go down go, go down there some there is the uh, thing. And the amazing part starts. <laughs> yeah. Only remember this place from the music. Yep. 
Oh, it's coins. Uh, crap. Uh, how many coins do you need? 20 coins. I got only 12. But I don't think you are uh, required in order to kill. You don't need to kill the enemies with 4 coins, but they're just actually there to make things a little easier. But I'm just gonna, now gonna start killing the enemies from uh, the point. Besides, I do need a little bit coins for that. But I also wasted 100 coins! <laughs> See, 100. I guess it's a good thing I'm just gonna die. I, I'm gonna die quick. So now I can now know my paths. And I'm going to little 50 coins. Let's get this going. Let's get things going. So now let's do well worth the uh, steps. And also, this is the whole point is that Pumas need to dash. That's easy way to kill them for us. It is, of course, stomping on their heads. <laughs> Pumas! Crap! It is so difficult to platform something that we're going to have to rely on the spin jump. It's really difficult. That Aksumba, I don't like the way they give Aksumba the ability to shoot rocks. Uh, let me actually just get on that on the top so it can shoot. So you can get the Axiom back on the bot. I'm actually going to have a coin. Uh, 50 coins! 50 coins. 50 coins. Yeah, this is actually one of the most difficult things you can do out there. <laughs> Except for the next one, this is actually easy if you know your nostalgia. Uh, 50 coins. Let's do it. I think it actually gives you enough coins from the... I don't know if you actually... how you know... Okay, this is doing that to us. I didn't get to like... didn't get to collect a coin! Oh, uh, that's not like Star Wars in this game better than coins! <laughs> Easy collectible is easy. Especially the ones from Max. Yeah, I guess it's just because well, they, these the ones that, that you, from the ones you kill, have obey gravity. And the one they're basically set up like that one there. Is a little difficult. I think there are some stuff downstairs in order to get there, but not here. And this one has not on, you should actually get this. Maybe we'll just see from here that there is a platform there. The bonus coins, I'm pretty sure. We should probably do need it, so I can gonna move on. No, basically, if you were able to capture any coins you may have uh, missed. That's good. Kind of wanted on that first platform game, but no, I didn't get it. <laughs> well, if that happened. <laughs>
killed with that timbers and that one's very jam. He killed Gretchen Bell, didn't he? Gretchen Bell. Oh yeah, I remember that time. Uh, if you hit an enemy... Okay, I'm gonna just have to test it out on the Google. On the Google. Okay, let me just try... Uh, yeah, me, okay, I can, can, I'm gonna try to test out the field. Let me just see what I can do. If I can do that. Yes, I can. Okay, good. Good, good. Since I'm able, so basically I'm able to spin jump, even if I already had spin jump. So I can do another spin jump, even if I hit on enemies since they turn into the platform. That way I'm able to collect the coins that come from the heads. But when things can happen like that, that's kind of it out of my reach. Where the way to this really difficult position. Oh, come on, come on, come on. He's just spinning his rocks at me. Spinning his rocks at me, it sounds like uh, familiar. Why is people have a oh yeah, so I guess then again the This is actually kinda like uh Deku Scrubs. Yeah, I guess they were like Deku Scrubs. I can make the sound of strokes. There we go, 15 coins. I know. Things are looking good for me. So that, uh, and if we, uh, yeah, I'm, not, I'm going to be patient about this. Okay, he's coming, he's coming this way. I can hear him. There we go. And here you can see me. <laughs> 27 points right now. I need to need to, need to do a double check soon. Right now I got all the coins except for a few. Oh, okay. You just need to double check. Thirty coins. Thirty coins. Good. I knew that collecting coins can be so difficult. I will make some progress. Yeah, it's a simple hammer, it's a simple hammer, it's nothing more. And you're able also to pass time or to uh, make it a little easier for yourself. And the distortion music is not actually doing that. <laughs> but it makes you feel like an adventure. At least I, at least I got the checkpoint. At least I got the checkpoint. <laughs> I died between time, between time, and time to slow down. That looks cool. <laughs> 
Alhamdulillah. No I like you that there are those hammers that we did there, just to be in your way. There is also a hammer that uh, helps you with that getting the one off if you want, but I don't like that. I really like the sound is also uh, in slow motion. Really? You're kidding me. You're kidding me. <laughs> Straight ass. <laughs> Now I got that out of the way, let's do the wheel mission, and then we're going to the to that uh, galaxy known as well, Throwback Galaxy. The Lech Hammer Trap. Get those into pits. Get over 1,000 uh, star bits. <laughs> my, uh, my star bits can now uh, advance. The Luigi says goodbye. Yes, I know that my green one almost died. There's this, and then the last two. It's so only three more stars to win there. Alright, time for adventure. For real this time. <laughs> and this time I'll let Mario take care of this adventure time. And that could must soon get. <laughs> Is that soon? He went up there on purpose. You're yeah, dying. Like poof. Well, actually, that poof in that key is kind of here, so he probably went to screen. I like the chirp. I like the chirps from uh, this lock right here. I love that it is really just like chirping. Now it's time for the real essential. Collect some coins out of the way, so why not? <laughs> because I love hitting those blocks. Mm. <laughs> those walls need to go. <laughs> Those walls need to go. I was I was uh, serious about that. No, you're not gonna have experience the gratification, my friend. You will. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> that was a uh, little bit weird, but whatever. <laughs> Stick on top of this. Send you to the abyss. <laughs> You can hit this and lock the cage. You don't need to do this, you can simply get on there. Thank you, it was time to smell moldy in the cage. The star is up ahead. Up in. Oh, this is such a really good adventure time. Rolling. We have temple as puzzles with the uh, little flow of gravity. That's really what you. That's what we really like. That. Well, actually, not puzzles, obstacles. That's what we really like about that. With interesting traps. <laughs> that's something that I really will really agree on. That this is a way cool place. And also, uh, fine, fine. Let me just get uh, the. Uh, come, can come down, can come down, please, thank you. Simply get on the wall, get on this, uh, on this thing, and, well, ride a rhythm, and you're able to get the card now. Mm. 
and it was like a one up, since it was only one up. I was like, he was snatched away from me. <laughs> Spikes. <laughs> Simply what you expect. <laughs> it's not all thing. That is the ground party. It's such a scenic view. And you can also hear, uh, the chirps. The chirps of a block beckoning to me. You hear those chirps? Also the chirps of a block beckoning. Oh my. 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 I guess this world also not only does hate, has my most favorite boss, also one of the most annoying bosses in the entire uh, game. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. I guess this pipe leads you to... Well, simply bonus stage. Coins, bruh. Uh, you probably need to appear way sooner. Find a treasure room. Yeah, this actually basically is a treasure room. Get in the coin. There we go, going one up, and as far as as, as confetti. Alright. So let's do the go with and die. <laughs> okay, I don't know what's in the, in all these blocks on now. A coin. Let's see. So, some star bits and some and a coin. Make your Wiimote ready. There we go. There's the star. The treasure. The gold. The gold is right there. All we have to do is write this. Hope you're good at writing that. <laughs> like me. There we go. And you got the gold. A star. And now, for the final... For the final level, which I will show. <laughs> the final level, which I will show. My... Do you really remember that bigger leg thing? Oh, let's see what's happening. My last level for you. It's a shame, man, it's a new game, Holly Hop Galaxy. If you're gonna take, swing on by. Not now. Not now. That will be for next time. Along after I'm done with that. Uh, throwback Galaxy. <laughs> Made it sure last time, so let's make it a big one. <laughs> throwback Galaxy. This one looks sure to look familiar, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm gonna stop being coy when you have met the galaxy. Return of the Womp King. Yep, this is basically is Womp's Fortress. Well, it really is Womp Fortress from Super Mario, really, Super Mario 64. Hey! Hey you! Guy with the stats, you came along just in time. What you doing with me, baby? We got the, st the star back from the one king at the top of the hill. And yes, if this music, is, this music is really an indication that this actually is from Super Mario 64. There's two levels that actually comes from, uh, but that has, has an, uh, something designed after the, uh, from another from another game. This is actually from from Super Mario 64 and well Super Mario Sunshine, and they're actually based in the same game actually. What are they level doing stuff? Piranha plants? I don't mind if I do. I 
And yes, this is also actually the same mission, except because it added a twist at the end. A modernized boss against the Bomb King. And yes, that is also alongside Big like my favorite boss in the entire game. No, oh, but still. It is such a really cool boss. It's just a cool boss. Throwback is really just what this is. This is really one of my. This basically is my favorite stage in this entire game. Uh, and this is also my favorite music, and this little is my favorite. This perfect mission. My favorite mission in the entire game. Just yeah, literally everything. Even Wiggler. Wiggler is not actually doesn't do doesn't do a twist because normally there will be a uh, wands here. Hey, Statman. That's a really scary gap happening. I don't know, I can count on you and your fantastic stats. Please take that, take, take back that stuff. If this is actually supposed to be actually, um. Uh, about that womp we just saw, that womp on the top is actually based on. Well, you don't see right now. Um, that womp is how the womp king originally looked like. At least, basically, it was a bigger womp, but it is, this is right here, it's just a simple womp. Also, they're actually also at the same time, on the same side, but the Womp King is a different story. Because he gained an actually different design in 2564 DS. And this is an entirely different boss for him, so. Here it is, the Womp King. It makes me so mad! We built your houses, your castles, we bathed your roads, and still you walk all over us! Do you ever say thank you? No! Well, you're not gonna wipe your feet on me. I think I could crush you just for fun. Do you have a problem with that? Just try to ground pound the Womp King! Ha! This is the Womp King, and he comes with Diggalax music. Let me get rid of that star business, actually. Simply, this Bezu is like, first thing first, he comes with I said this, they were waiting for one thing, but he comes with an added trace that he will have these things called wins. <laughs> and also, he creates shark waves when he ground pants. You can't do the trick, uh, uh, this really is a better one. This basically is the most awesomest boss, but people love this boss at all because of that. Plus, dig like music, it so makes it, it a, makes it an awesome touch. Uh, they actually had text like, how dare you attack the Womp King, something like that. Their, their first name is both the Wimps, but this is basically a new type of Wimp, and they basically die instantly when they use their Wimp attack. Yeah, the days are basically kamikaze bombs. They also affect the, uh, also got affected by his, uh, well, not only did he kick, uh, kill him instantly, but he does all sorts of things. But then he's gonna be dead. No! Crushed again! I'm just a stepping stone after all. I want gravel. Uh, gravel. Okay, you win. Here, take this, take this with you. Uh, dang it. Yeah, there we go. There goes the Womb King. <laughs> And I hope you enjoyed. See you guys next time.